Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you to uh, a very talented young man. He plays the guitar and he sings with his mouth. We like to call him Mouth Guitar. Mouth Guitar, come on out. Uh, all right, here's the deal, guys. Uh, no kidding. I met Alex last night when I was performing live at Albrecht, uh, Albrecht College. I almost said Albrecht like Alex Albrecht. But uh, he was a volunteer for one of the uh, routines, and it turns out that uh, that, that he's I'm friends not going to spray you like John. a skunk and come up closer to the computer you don't need to be well, in no, the no. corner he's got, like, he, look, like he's, a, he's got this whole he's got this whole gear set up look at this oh business. jesus oh, okay he's got, all right he's got loops and distorters and all kinds of stuff i, I just thought that he was in the corner like like some sort of baroque chamber music performer <laughs> oh yeah no he's very he's very he's very scared of you and your well, sound lady, i will sing <laughs> all right so uh, real quick uh, uh alex how long have you been playing guitar and what do you describe your style as because this is like crazy industrial techno stuff I'm seeing here. Um, I've been playing for about 10 years. Um, I most closely relate my stuff to percussive finger style. It's like August Rush, if you've seen that, or uh, Andy McKee, some of those guys. Um, but it's a lot of really experimental stuff. As you could tell, like my pedal board is kind of ridiculous. And we get, we get that again, actually. We'll jump this over right here. There we go. And so you have how many modules in there? Um, there's like Eight or ten different things going on. There's like eight or ten different things going on. Um, yeah, probably not that many. Two, four, or six. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, there. Yeah, <laughs> awesome. All right, well, here's what I'm gonna do. What? And, and you just uh, you have a, a a new album that you just that just came out. Um, not new. It was 2009, late 2009. But you have an old album that you're gonna play. Way to sell it, kiddo. Yeah. And and and, and there will be some new stuff too because I desperately need to get back into the studio. So depending on how much time that I've got. Okay, well, what what are you, you going to play for us? Uh, this first one's going to be yeah, a song called Ice Mountain, and it it doesn't use too much of that, but then we'll get there. Okay, awesome. Well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to set this up. I'm going to. You guys in the chat room will have to let us know if if you're receiving this okay. But I'm going to try to set this up so we get as much action as possible. Here we go. Thank you very, very much. What was that called again? Brubaker. Breaker. 
Oh, Brew Baker. I like it. He's trying to toughen up your image is what it is. He's trying to give you a gangster image with Brew Breaker. You break all the brews. Uh, and we're yes. recording all this low, so we'll be able to get the good quality in there for sure. Uh, dude, fantastic. Uh, dude, I, I don't even know. This will be kind of weird. We're just going to drop this segment in in the middle of our awesome night attack after party. What do you say, Justin? Uh, I say yes. We are going to drop this in to our <laughs> weird night attack after party. Uh, okay, uh, so so uh, Alex, what else? What else? What else? Uh, do you got anything else you want to plug? Is it could be where, where can people get your album? Um, iTunes, Amazon as well. Um, CD Baby, and I've got a website, uh, alexbrewbakerguitar.com. So you can find out all sorts of stuff there. Um, I blog fairly often, uh, music related things uh, and the like that can be found through the website as well. So. Dude, well, thank you so much, Alex. Here, you want to play us out? All right, here we go.
Awesome. Now I'm sure I'm sure we got all kinds of uh, Skype Skype uh, artifacting on there, but like sitting there right next to the amp, uh, it creates like some seriously spooky soundscapes. I really enjoyed that, dude. No, uh, I, I seriously I, listen. I've never regretted taking acid more than I do right now, <laughs> having listened to Alex Brubaker. Uh, folks, everybody head out to Amazon, pick up his album. A lot of you were saying this is the album I want to write code to. This is the album I want to make love to a clown to. And yes, the soundtrack to our lives is authored by Alex Brubaker. Thank you so much for coming.